Hello and welcome to Lobajit Gaming. So in this video, I wanted to cover the best games for PC under 2GB. So under 2GB in size and uh, that don't need more than 2GB RAM. So basically games for low-end PCs. Um, this was an idea suggested by one of the viewers and I thought this was a good idea. Now before I begin, I just wanted to give a quick shout out to Cold Beer. So this is another YouTuber I just came across and he's also made a bunch of videos on the Steam Winter Sale. Now a lot of you were asking me for um, a list of games, RPG games. And this guy has just made three videos on RPGs. So we have indie RPGs, we have uh, RPGs like uh, Diablo and CRPGs. So you can check out his videos and get some ideas for RPGs. I'll link one of the videos watch them see if they're useful give him a subscribe tell him lbg sent you and yeah sounds like a really fun dude like he's hilarious his videos are very funny anyway i uh, just wanted to give him a shout out because it seems like a useful channel so onto our list we start with papers please you can see here overwhelmingly positive reviews i played it i did a full let's play of this on the channel when i first made the channel because this is such an awesome game uh, you are basically a border agent uh, on like a fictional country and your job is to check the papers of people coming through and look for any forgeries, any uh, illegal stuff and you know just follow the instructions of your government but there is a story going on around it as well where you can maybe let some people pass and maybe you know get some money out of it for yourself because you are living in a very difficult situation as well and yeah so you have to be careful you have to worry about your family and providing for them at the same time you have to make sure uh, you follow the laws and stuff so tricky game and it's got uh, interesting outcomes like different endings like 20 endings or something like 20 different endings and yeah so really fun game it's not expensive it's made by one person lucas pope he also made return of the opera tin which is also another favorite game of mine this is 50% off, 174 rupees only, 499 dollars, 349 pounds, and 499 euros. 725 Australian dollars, 549 Canadian dollars. Now, this one is a very, very small game. Uh, you just need a 2 GB RAM and 100 MB hard disk space. Like very easy to run. Next is Ion Fury. So I, I really like this game. I needed an excuse to put this game, and here it is. So this is a boomer shooter, an old 90s retro style FPS game. Came out last year, so it's a brand new game, but made on an old engine, uh, the build engine. And it is obviously made for modern systems, so it, it supports everything, but widescreen and everything. And this is one of those games where if you have anything half decent, you'll get to F40 FPS constant easy. And it's very fun to play as well. This is 40% off. 341 rupees, 1499 dollars, 1169 pounds, 1259 euros, 2157 Australian dollars, 1739 Canadian dollars, and this is also probably under 100 MB. Let's see, uh, 100 MB this space, and you just need 1 GB RAM and 512 video memory as well. This shouldn't be too difficult. It's also got OpenGL and DirectX, so you could use either one to run it on your system. Next is of course Stardew Valley, one of the most popular indie games and this one recently got a new update, uh, 1.5 just released a few days ago, I think on the 21st or something. So it's got some brand new content, you get like a beach uh, farm as well or something. I've played a bit of it but I've never been able to get into it and I'm thinking of you know trying it again. This is 33% off, 320 rupees, 999 dollars, 736 pounds. 937 euros, 1138 Australian dollars, 1138 Canadian dollars. And let's look at the system requirements quickly. Yeah, 2 GB RAM, 500 MB hard disk space. Easy PC. Next up is Dead Cells. So, a very popular game. Um, platformer, roguelike, uh, difficult as well. It's got excellent music and a lot of uh, game replayability, you could say. Really fun game. And this is 40% off, 377 rupees, 1499 dollars, 1319 pounds, 1499 euros, 2157 Australian dollars, 1799 Canadian dollars. And they've also been adding a few DLCs for it. So you've got Rise of Giant is free. The Bad Seed was added, I think, or yeah, uh, 11th February. And there's also, 
I've heard there's something else coming or I can't remember but I've heard there was another some a DLC or something coming anyway so again very easy to run yes uh, let me see 2 GB RAM 500 MB space yeah easy peasy next is don't stop so I've been mentioning don't stop together as in like co-op categories etc this is the single player game survival game uh, it's got good art style at least it's not pixel art for people who don't like uh, the pixel art style overwhelmingly positive and you can see it is let me just check the price first 75 percent off 87 rupees 249 dollars 179 pounds two euros and four cents 362 australian dollars 287 canadian dollars now let's have a look at the specs uh one gb ram 500 mb hard disk space next is celeste so another popular platformer i also have heard this is difficult pixel art of course but it's won a lot of awards overwhelmingly positive this was given away free by the epic game store so if you have it you can just play it instead of buying it again 75 percent off 141 rupees 499 dollars 374 pounds 499 euros 723 australian dollars 549 canadian dollars and let's quick look at the specs 2 gb ram intel hd and 1.2 gb disk space darkest dungeon so this is surprisingly easy to run another game that looks good it's not your pixel art stuff but you don't need a lot of memory or ram to run this if you did not uh, pick it up from epic you can buy this on a big sale here as well 75 percent off 154 rupees 624 dollars 474 pounds 574 euros 898 australian 699 canadian um, if you did pick it up you can be certain it will run on your system unless you have like an ancient pc or something but this one just needs 2 gp ram and 2 gp hard disk space next is super meat boy so a very difficult platformer this was i believe the second or third game given away by the epic game store so again if you're picking games on epic from the start you should have this if not this is very cheap right now 90 percent off only 47 rupees 149 dollars one pound and nine cents uh, nine pence 139 euros 215 australian dollars 169 canadian dollars this is a very challenging game so a lot of people just get this to test their skills i guess and this is uh where is it okay one gb ram and 300 mb hard disk space that's all you need next is owl boy so another pixel graphics game but this one actually looks really nice to me like the style of the art is really nice and this is i'm not sure but i think this might have been free as well on the epic game so that they've given away so many games i just feel like this this is something they could have given away 40% off 371 rupees 1499 dollars 1139 pounds 1379 uh, euros 2099 australian dollars 1679 canadian dollars look at the specs G 1 gb ram 600 mb hard disk space sonic mania so a recent game but it's made in the old art style meaning it's easy to run very fun game that's sort of like the early first few games uh, on the sega mega drive and this is 75 percent off 166 rupees 499 dollars 374 pounds 499 euros 624 australian dollars 624 canadian dollars and specs 2 gb ram 400 mb hard disk space next next is slay the spire so this is sort of like a our deck builder type game with combat elements uh, i have this game i haven't tried it but again you can see overwhelmingly positive reviews it's, it's a card game with combat elements i think that's how it works 50 percent off 284 rupees 1249 dollars 974 pounds 1049 uh, euros 1797 australian dollars 1449 canadian dollars and also that the specs 2 gb ram 1 gb hard disk space then we have Invisible Incorporated, and this is a stealth cyberpunk turn based strategy style of game made by the same people who made Don't Starve, etc. So, um, looks really nice. It's not the usual pixel art stuff. 
It's cheap as well, 75% off, 132 rupees, 499 dollars, 374 pounds, 499 euros, 723 Australian dollars, 549 Canadian dollars. And a quick look at the specs, 2 GB RAM, 2 GB hard disk space. And then finally, Among Us. So the most popular game of the year probably. A lot of people playing this, overwhelmingly positive, and it's quite cheap as well. So yeah, 20% off, 159 rupees. $399, 319 pounds, 319 euros, 6 Australian dollars, 455 Canadian dollars. Look at the player numbers. 70,000 right now and peak daily today of over 100,000, 125,000. Yeah, awesome. And you got some skins as well, like pet skins and stuff. And I don't know how big this is. Must be really small. 250 MB disk space, 1 GB RAM. So really easy to run. So yeah, those were some games for low-end PCs, games that require less than 2 GB hard drive space and 2 GB RAM. So it should be helpful for everyone. And yeah, um, I'll see what else I can make. Thank you for watching as always, and see you in the next one.